Good afternoon and happy Mother's Day. We're live here at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway Road Course for the Verizon Brickyard Grand Prix. It's Mother's Day. And what better present for mom than to bring home the trophy here at Indy. Let's take a look at your drivers to watch for. Chase Briscoe starts on pole for today's race. He won here last year. Alongside Chase Elliott, who was fighting him for the win up until the last lap. When in the final corner, he spun out, crashed into the wall. Ryan Blaney, DNF'd last week at Gateway. Hoping to rebound from this and have a strong result here at Indy. Joey Logano spun out early in the race last week at Gateway. Lost the points lead because of it. Hoping to somehow regain that points lead here today. Kyle Larson. Last week's winner at Gateway. Got He's got some good, foot, good momentum coming into Indy today. We'll see what he can do. Denny Hamlin starting deep in the field for today's race. His points lead could be in jeopardy. As Logano, third place point man, is a bunch of positions ahead of him. And Kevin Harvick, second place point man, starts dead last today. He's gonna need he's gonna need to make up some positions if he wants to get back to the points lead. Now let's go trackside for the command. Drivers, start your Cars fired up and roll off for 12 laps around the Indy Road Course. Now let's look at your starting lineup. On the pole is the 14 of Chase Briscoe, and who's outside is the 9 of Chase Elliott. Behind them, we have Daniel Suarez and Ryan Blaney. Then it's Joey Logano and Tyler Reddick. Then we have Kyle Busch and Ross Chastain. Behind them, it's Austin Sindrick and Cole Custer. Then we have Kyle Larson and Bubba Wallace. Behind them, Austin Dillon and Christopher Bell. And it's Martin Truex Jr. and Harrison Burton. Behind them, we have Alex Bowman and Chris Buescher. Then it's Denny Hamlin and Ty Dillon. Then we got Brad Keselowski and Derek Almarola. Behind them, William Byron and Eric Jones. And running out the field, it is Kevin Harvick. We're ready for green flag racing. Here at Indy. Green flag is out in the air. Oh, we've got trouble already. Cole Custer and Kyle Larson off. They're able to get it back going. Austin Dillon is stopped. Right there at the, uh, the hairpin there. Local yellow out right now. And now we're under a full course caution. The three of Austin Dillon. Heavy nose damage to that car. Let's take a look at what happened. There's the three car. Oh, it looks like he just locked up. Got into the back of Larson. Piled into him. That's where he got that nose damage from. Then he parked it in the uh, the hairpin there. Let's take a look at it again. Yeah, locked up, piled in the Larson. Good job by Bubble by Bubble Wallace to avoid going wide there in the corner, avoiding both Custer and Larson. Tough break for Dylan. He'll be out of the race. We're ready to restart on lap four out of twelve here at Indy. Green flag is back out. Briscoe able to jump out. Elliot will fall in behind him. Briscoe continuing to set the pace here at Indy. Elliot trying to chase him down for... Oh! 
Joey Logano. Blowing up. He's not able to get the car going. That's going to bring out a full course caution. The 22 of Joey Logano. Smoke billowing from that car. Comes to a rest in the runoff area of turn one. Tough break for him. Third place point leader, or third place point man. Will not be able to regain the points lead today. He is out of the race. We are ready to restart with four. We are ready to restart with five laps to go here at Indy. Green flag is back out. Oh, and around they go. Big wreck. Busher up and over. Caution is out. Chris Busher up and over. Alex Bowman involved. Martin Truex Jr. Kyle Bush. Heavy nose damage. So too Bubba Wallace. Major accident here at Indy. What happened? Oh, Syndra got into the back of Bubba Wallace. That caused a stack up from there. Wow. Busher just launching off the back of Alex Bowman. Sending that car up and over. Bubba goes around. Tags. Truex gets hit by Bush. Bush gets piled into by Bowman. And Busher piles into Bowman and launches off the back of him. Big wreck on the restart here at Indy. Austin Sindra getting in the bubble wall is causes a chain reaction stack up. And Busher ends up on his roof. Here it is in real time. Big wreck. Here it ended. The red flag is out. Here it ended. Lots of cleanup going on in turn one. As the track is essentially blocked. going to take a while before we're able to, to uh, get back racing. Tough break for all of these guys. They're out of the race. As now the red flag has been lifted, we are back under yellow flag condition. There's Martin Triggs Jr. on pit road. He was involved in the crash. Didn't get too much damage though, so he'll be able to continue. He'll restart in the back. We're ready to restart with three laps to go here at Indy. Green flag is back. Oh, Briscoe locks up going into one. Loses a ton of spots. Chase Elliott, now your leader. Two to go here at Indy. Will Brian Blaney have anything for him? Here he goes to the inside. Can't quite get there. He comes back to the inside of Elliott. White flag in the air. Will Blaney have anything for him? One last effort here in the final corner. Chase Elliott wins it by a car lane. What a finish. Briscoe looked like he had it in the bag. He dominated the race. Locks up on the final restart. Which allows Chase Elliott to sneak into first. And is able to hold off Ryan Blaney and take the win here at Indy. He'll take the checker flag and burn it down. 
congratulations to Chase Elliott for winning the Verizon Brickyard Grand Prix. Here are your final results. Chase Elliott gets the win here at Indy. Blaney coming in second. Reddick third. Suarez and Chastain take home fourth and fifth. Double top five for the Trackhouse Racing Team. Sendrick finishing the day with the, with the top ten. Hamlin and Harvick after starting in the back both are able to finish in the top ten. Chase Briscoe Locked up on the final restart. Lost the race, but was able to rebound to finish 10th. Larson, last week's winner. Finishing just outside the top 10. Martin Truex Jr. Involved in that big wreck. Late in the race. Finishing 19th. Chris Bush are going up and over. In that wreck. Joey Logano was third in points. Was hoping to uh, get back the points lead. Blew an engine. Made a race. Finishes 24th. And here are your point standings after today. Danny Hamlin maintains his points lead. Just a two point gap between him. Between he and Kevin Harvick. Elliott moves up to third in the standings. 19 points back from the leader. Tyler Reddick moves up to 4th, Suarez up to 5th, Larson down to 6th, Blaney up to 7th, Logano all the way down to ninth. Kyle Busch moves down to 10th in the standings. Lots of jostling going on in the points. As drivers try to get every point they can to get closer. To the top of the points, top of the point bracket. Next week, we stay in Indy, but this time on the oval. For the first time since season one, we'll be running the Indy oval layout for the Brickyard 400. I hope you enjoyed this race. This is Brandon Gomez in the booth, signing off. <laughs>